Welcome back. It's a true icon of Atlanta, and after being out of the spotlight since 2015, the Atlanta Cyclorama is about to make headlines again. On Friday, the huge 360 degree painting makes its way to the Atlanta History Center in Buckhead. Good day, Atlanta's Paul Milliken got an inside look uh, to give us an exclusive first look at it. Long before the days of 3D, 4K, VR, and CGI, this was the headline-grabbing immersive experience that quite literally turned heads. It was painted in 1886 as a commercial venture by the American Panorama Company in Milwaukee, and it is the IMAX theater of its day. The Battle of Atlanta measures 49 by 371 feet, surrounding viewers with a vivid Civil War scene. 17 German artists spent months creating the massive work of art known as a cyclorama. They were basically yeah. an art form that was popular for a, a period of 30 years. Mm -hmm. And uh, in the 1880s, when this painting was painted, we were at the peak of the cyclorama bat. The Atlanta cyclorama spent decades in this Grant Park building until the Atlanta History Center built it a brand new home in Buckhead. Along with painstakingly restoring the painting, artists also spruced up the diorama elements surrounding it. All 128 plaster figures have been repaired and repainted, including the most famous one of all. You know, I gotta ask you, why is Clark Gable part of this thing? Well, Clark Gable, the story goes, uh, showed up for the premiere of Gone with the Wind and told Mar uh, Mayor Hartsfield after touring the cyclorama at Grant Park, I really like it, but I'm not in it. That's the only thing wrong with it. <laughs> and so uh, the mayor, uh, as the story has it, uh, commissioned a rendition of Clark Gable as a uh, dead Yankee on the diorama platform. For artist and Atlanta native Alec Adelton, the chance to work on a painting she first saw as a little kid is beyond surreal. It absolutely blows my mind. Like I don't, I don't understand. I have no context yeah. for this experience at all. Yeah. And I, to be honest with you, I had, I don't know if this is just my brain, but like I almost had a memory of when I was really little, looking at like finding little things that I was like, well, I mean, if I, if I could work on that. And now, thanks in part to her work, so many new generations will be inspired by a painting that's truly come full circle. Paul Milliken, Good Day Atlanta. Wow, tickets for Cyclorama, so cool. the big picture on sale right now. Nice. That is really cool how they make it look so realistic. It's yeah. just amazing. I'm like her, I'm like, this boggles the mind. Well, it's good to found a new home too. Yes, yeah, absolutely. Gotta stop by and see it.